proposals for this emergency cover review. Our proposals for improving emergency response in line with new and emerging risks in Lancashire are as follows. 1. Introduce a more resilient and flexible whole-time duty system at seven fire stations. These are Skelmersdale, Morecambe, Lancaster, Southshore, Fleetwood, Bispam, Hindburn. Whilst we propose to introduce flexible day crewing at Penwortham and St Anne's fire stations. Current stations, 39. Proposed stations, 39. Current fire appliances, 58. Proposed fire appliances, 58. Current total number of whole-time firefighters, 502. Proposed total number of whole-time firefighters, 527. Current overall annual cost, £31,893,669. Proposed overall annual cost, £32,000,000. £108,620. St Anne's currently has two fire engines, one crewed under the day crewing plus duty system and one crewed by on-call firefighters. Penwortham currently has one fire engine crewed under the day crewing plus duty system. We propose replacing crewing arrangements at both stations to flexible day crewing, while there will be no change to the on-call crewing at St Anne's. These proposed changes would mean no change to emergency cover during daytime, however firefighters would respond from their home at night. This will increase the average response time at night by 2 minutes and 47 seconds, but does not affect our ability to meet the required response standards. This model already works effectively at four other fire stations across Lancashire. The proposals reflect effective and efficient emergency cover given the risk and incident levels in both areas and the ability of neighbouring fire appliances to cover the area. 2. Optimise emergency cover through dynamic mobilising software. Introducing a new software system that provides dynamic mobilising data to inform real-time decision-making on how best to deploy resources to incidents will improve emergency cover and response times. 3. Strengthen our response to climate change emergencies. To strengthen our emergency response to wildfires and flooding in areas of high risk, we propose introducing four fire appliances with off-road capabilities subject to successful trials. We will trial two vehicles adapted into fire appliances that are suitable for off-road travel in the eastern area of Lancashire to give improved access to rural areas in the event of flooding and wildfires. These innovative vehicles will replace existing fire appliances during the trials and, subject to evaluation, another two will be introduced in the northern and Pennine areas of the county. We also plan to train eight floodwater incident managers and establish two floodwater tactical advisors. 4. Strengthen firefighting and rescue capabilities in high-rise buildings. We plan to introduce a 45-meter aerial ladder platform, an ALP, our highest reach aerial capability to date. We have considered the learning from the fire at Grenfell Tower and plan to introduce a 45-meter ALP at Preston to strengthen firefighting and rescue capabilities in high-rise buildings. Lancashire has increasing numbers of high-rise buildings, with the majority located in the Preston area. The city is also a central location from which to reach the rest of the county. We will also invest in two additional water towers that can penetrate building exteriors and deliver water at height in northern and western areas. 5. Broaden on-call firefighting capabilities to strengthen operational response. We plan to expand training opportunities to enable on-call firefighters at some stations to crew the proposed off-road fire appliances in areas at high risk of climate change emergencies and operate water towers. We will also explore the potential for our on-call firefighters to drive a range of special appliances to improve our speed of response for some of these vehicles. Broadening the range of skills and knowledge among on-call crews will strengthen operational response and resilience. 
consultation. For a more in-depth look at our proposed changes in our emergency cover review, please visit our website. Consultation is now open and we would love to hear your views which will help shape the future of our fire and rescue service in Lancashire. Scan the QR code to open the questionnaire.